Well, my name is Chris Zasa. I've coached Max for a little bit. You know, I believe in a lot of things in life, but Max brought me to believe in a lot more. And older people can teach me things, but Max taught me a lot of things that nobody else will be able to teach me in life. And God showed him the way, so God's going to show me the way too. And is it Chris? Is that right? Yes. Chris, let me ask you, have you believed upon Christ? Do you believe he is your Savior? Yes. Amen. Are you ashamed of Jesus Christ? Amen. God bless you, brother. The most important decision you can ever make. And you're going to have Max yeah, as a, his example? Don't believe you. Don't believe you. Okay. <laughs> All right, you can yell down. Chris, upon your public profession of faith in Jesus Christ and the fact that you're not ashamed of him, we now baptize you, our brother, in the name of the Father, the Son, and the Holy Ghost. You want to help him? Buried in the likeness of his death, as we're all in the back. Raised in the likeness of his resurrection. We need to walk the way to the Are you from up in the Lord Beast, right? Yeah, this guy's from up in my neck of the woods, and I remember him from wrestling practices with my son, his wrestling coach. You know what's interesting? Real quick, all of this, every connection here is from wrestling. Every single person I met, every single person here, every single one of them that got baptized today, the connection is wrestling. It's not church. It's not anything else other than some dumb goon with bald head who said, okay, I'll, I'll coach wrestling. The point is, you can be a light and shine anywhere. You can use any gift, any talent, even wrestling, to bring people to Christ. So, how awesome is that? Right. See, I've been uh, training Max the past year, year and a half, a little bit over that. And uh, when I first met Max, he uh, definitely needed like uh, he was looking for help. And I seen him on that mat. That's how I, that's how I met him. I mean, I go went over to you know plenty of different uh, high schools, clubs, tried helping out the kids, just giving them a little back. And I seen Max looked at me and I told him took this guy down and I'm like, hey, you gotta lift that ankle and keep sitting back, sit, sitting back up and grabbing on you. He's like, lift the ankle. I said, yeah, try it. So what he does is, uh, you know, he gets in on a takedown, gets the guy on his butt, picks the ankle up and then looks back and he's like, come on. he's not getting up, he's not getting up. And all of a sudden I look over and his mom, Dana, who's a blessing. I mean, if I hadn't met Max and his family, I, I, I don't know, uh, a lot of things I'd be doing right now, you know, but they kind of brought me into the light and seen a lot better ideas to go by. And following those ideas, I gotta say, uh, Max has uh, supported me 100%. Anytime I say something or, you know, it's kind of negative, he, he redirects it and it's like, okay, it kind of makes me think about it and then next time I talk to him, I'll, I'll always, uh, you know, think about asking him or saying something before him because he will correct you. I mean, as his teacher said, he is a genius. I mean, in his brain, I don't know what goes on. I don't know if anybody else does, but he he is one. He definitely knows a lot more than a lot of people. And just bringing that knowledge to me really made me realize a lot of things in life that, uh, you know, positivity is the best and the right way to go because it, you know, just creates uh, good vibes and everybody around you is happy people. And, you know, you just want to do things and bring, bring each other in together and kind of accomplish them together. So I'm going to do this for Max today. And me, I'm a believer for sure. Hey. You know, but now uh, I guess I'm going to have to join my brother over here. Nick, you have accepted Christ as your Savior. Yes, sir. And you're not ashamed of him today. I'm not. You want to follow him in obedience. I'm always. Amen. Amen. God bless you, man. All right. We now baptize your brother in the name of the Father, the Son, and the Holy Ghost, during the likeness of his death, raised in the likeness of his resurrection. You can say that for you. I think we have one more. This is Jacob. Uh, yeah, hi, my name's Jacob. Uh, I'm, doing, I'm also going to do this for Max because. Uh, I've been uh, going to his house every Sunday because I want to be a wrestler like him. I look up to Max as he's a, uh, and uh, Coach Nick because he's uh, teaching me and uh, Max has just been uh, helping me uh, just get there. 
and uh, I'm going to the high school uh, next in a little while after summer. I'm going to high school, so I'm nervous about wrestling, but yeah, he's just gonna bring me there. Let me ask you, Dave, but I know you've come to church here quite a few times, and I know you've been seeking God. Uh, have you accepted Christ as your Savior? Yes, I have. Amen. Amen. All right. And you're not ashamed of Jesus? Nope. Not ashamed. You're going to follow him all the days you're going to Yes. God bless you. All right. We'll have you guys back next time. What a blessing. Jacob, upon your public profession of faith, we now baptize you, our brother, in the name of the Father, the Son, and the Holy Ghost. Buried in the likeness of his death, raised in the likeness of his resurrection. Even so, we walk in newness of life. Wow, praise God. Praise the Lord. We're almost running out of water, but... God is good, isn't he? What a blessing. Can I just say this? You never know whose life you're impacting. And so always shine. Don't be ashamed of Jesus. Shine for him. And uh, be a light. Because you never know who it is that God has brought into your life or brought across your path. That that person is searching. That person is looking. And you know, this world is a dark world, but it truly does need the light. The light of, of, of Jesus. Amen? Amen. Alright, I think that's it. We have to pray for blessing over these last few and then we'll dismiss. Let's pray. Lord, we love you. Oh, how